Okay, this is my video on this stuff here. Now this stuff is complete garbage. Garbage. This is the name of this stuff. Don Eagle, Don Eagle, whatever. It's crap. This is one gram. Look how big the goddamn container is. Huh? That's a huge bloody container. Just for one gram, okay? And this is twelve dollars. Twelve sixty. No, they had this in in quarters. I'm pretty sure it was what eighty four dollars. Everything in there is eighty four dollars for a quarter, seven grams. Now, if you're smart, you should know you could get a quarter for at least fifty sixty dollars on the street. Eighty four dollars is a rip off. The government is ripping you off. If you're gonna pay eighty four dollars for a quarter. You're stupid. Regardless if it's legal or not. It's a goddamn ripoff. And if this is what they're selling for $85 a quarter, you're a goddamn sucker. This stuff is shit. It gave me a headache from 7 8 p.m. till 9 a.m. the next morning. I met a friend that bought a different kind. Apparently that was supposed to give you energy and make you feel good. Just like this shit was supposed to be give you energy and you know, make you happy. Which is garbage. This gave me a goddamn headache. I had no energy. Nothing. And I smoked a whole gram within half an hour. Horse shit. Ten fucking dollars. That's what you should be paying for a gram. Not twelve dollars and sixty fucking cents. Point forty five percent THC totals twenty point eight. Well, twenty point eight he said was one of the highest THC counts that they had in the store. That's shit fucking THC. The only other one on the wall was 22% THC. Another 2% I can't imagine being any better than this. I mean... This stuff is shit. You know? Oh. No expiry date determined. No kidding. It's because you should smoke it before it even expires. Fuck. Anyway. This is my video on this shit fucking bunk. You know. Look at this case. You could probably fit five fucking lighters in there. You know, if you can get it in this stupid thing. And then to open this up, it's like a, a goddamn pill bottle. The lid just turns and turns and turns. That's fucking stupid. And apparently these Americans, the Americans are laughing at us Canadians because what, this is legal? Well, who cares? Because all you low-life Americans, your country's more fucked up than we are. You bash your own fucking president. You vote for the guy, and then you bash him. You people are losers. And then you make fun of this because we've been waiting how many years to be legal? And you already have it legal. Well, big deal. It doesn't hide the fact that you're all still a bunch of fucking losers. And then you laugh at us because it's just legal now. Well, you shoot and beat your citizens, and we don't. Your police officers kill black people. 
and other people just because they look like out of, out of place. You know, I just watched a video uh, last week, two weeks ago. A black guy owned a business. Police officer pulled up to his car, opened the car, walked in, you know, and just got into his car. Had no right to go in his car. Not pull up, open the door, get in, and then start bad mouthing the guy when he says, What are you doing in my car? And he says, Oh, I just wanted to see if it was yours. No, and if you watch the video, you'll see the cop was lying right through his teeth on his own dash cam. And then, what, I think it was about four or five other cops came, and they tasered him and beat the shit out of him. He owned a business. And he owned a car. See, down in the States, obviously, you're not allowed to own a business or a car unless you got the proper friends. Well, you still beat the shit out of your own citizens. You arrest them for fucking nothing. Yeah. Should be laughing at yourselves instead of us. This cannabis is a joke. You need to look at the laws. You can't smoke it nowhere. You can't take it nowhere. You pretty much have to sit in your own yard, go into your basement or into your own garage to smoke it. Smoking cigarettes, you can't even go onto a patio at the bar. You have to go away from it now. Bunch of stuck up old folks that need to uh, maybe get out of office. Yeah, your life is over. Go dry up somewhere and uh, let the younger generation take over like your time is finished. You're ruining everybody else's fucking life because you're upset that this is all happening now. Anyways. I'm going to smoke some real fucking pot. Yeah, and it's not from this goddamn place. And it sure as fuck is cheaper. And I'm pretty sure it's more than, what, 20.8%. Yeah, whatever. Do not buy this stuff. This stuff is a waste of money. It's not worth it. Look at this shit. 1 in 11 people who use cannabis will become addicted. Horse shit. By the time you're 16, you're already drunk and stoned. You're addicted at that time. It doesn't take marijuana to do it. I think the people that, you know, write these warnings and all these other things probably watched that stupid movie, Reef Reefer Madness. From what, the 50s and 60s? That movie is bullshit. And everybody that believed it is a fucking idiot. Who in their right mind acts like that when you're stoned on pot? Nobody. If you see that movie, watch it. It is so stupid. People don't smoke a joint and go jumping out of a goddamn window. And they don't start playing a piano fucking really fast. Like, you know, like, doesn't make no sense. Pot doesn't do that to you. These people fucking know it. It's stupid. You get the heroin off the streets. And then other shit down in, 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 the, in the States. What do you got that flaca? Right? And there's all other shit. You make it with fucking turpentine and all kinds of floor stripper. And you and, you, and Americans have the nerve to fucking laugh at us because of pot. Look what you're doing to your own people. Heroin. That flaca. Meth. All kinds of shit. Bunch of assholes. You should laugh at yourself. Fuck's sakes. Garbage. Complete garbage.